Hey guys, Melissa here, and I'm going to do my second attempt at making slime from Dollar Tree glue. I got a lot of different comments and suggestions from my last video, so I figured I would give those a few of those a shot and see if they worked. So for my first slime attempt, I am using the glitter glue that comes in a tin pack. I use the tin, the the red glitter glue because I it's just brighter and I like that color so I put in a borax activator um, what I use is just one cup of warm water and one teaspoon of borax mix that together and then I slowly pour that into my slime this is my go-to activator I think it works the best but for the last video I, w I used liquid starch and it did not work so so I just poured a little bit in, and as you can see, it's kind of thickening up a little bit, um, but not much. So I'm gonna add just a tiny bit more. And this is what I do in my other slimes. I just gradually add in the borax activator until it gets to that really thick consistency where it's not sticking to your hands. So this seems to be working a little bit better than the last time. It's definitely forming um, more of like a slime ball versus just like sludge. So you can see it's kind of sticking to my spoon and it's still pretty sticky, but not like last time. Last time it was like really watery and runny. Okay, it's still sticking to my hands. So I think I'm gonna add um, a little more borax, just a tiny bit, because I know a lot of people left comments and said, oh she put way too much in that's why it didn't work so I'm using little small amounts okay so now you know once you kind of get it where it won't stir very very much um, you kind of just knead it together and it's kind of forming a little bit but it's still really sticky you can see how much is sticking to my hands and that is not how slime is supposed to be it's supposed to be slimy but it's not supposed to stick to your hands See, it doesn't even come off the bowl. Yeah, too sticky. Needs more borax. Just a little bit. I'd love to hear in the comments, you guys, if you think that I'm adding too much, if I need to add something else, what works for you? Because so far, this is not working for me. I've tried two different ways to make it. I didn't add any water into this one like I did the last batch. It's just super sticky. This is this would not be any fun to play with. It would get everywhere. Nope. Okay, I'm gonna try to like play with it and knead it out on the table and see if maybe that'll help. Because sometimes when your when your slime is really sticky, and the more you play with it, the better it sets up and forms. So, I mean, it's working a little bit. I do love, love, love the red color, but this is just a mess. It's just all over my fingers. Yeah, and see how it sticks to the, the table? Nope. So it's a bust, guys. I couldn't get it to, to work. I, I added in very small amounts of borax. I played with it for a really long time. Um, I'm even going to try to add just a tiny, tiny bit more just to see if I can rub it around on the table and get it to, to not be sticky. I know a lot of people said you have to use borax. That's, that's the only thing that'll work with this glitter glue, but it did not work for me. So what do you guys think? What did I do wrong? Did the same, did you get the same results when you try to do it? Leave me a comment and let me know. Because it is better than last time. You know, you can at least still play with it, but it makes a huge mess and it gets everywhere and it sticks to things and it's just not a whole lot of fun to play with. And so now I'm gonna try, somebody suggested that I add a little bit of Elmer's clear glue. So I'm going to add a little bit of that and see if I can get it to kind of form a better slime ball where it's not sticking. And guys, I don't think it's going to work. 
I think that actually made it worse. And see how it's all over my hands? Okay, so this one is officially a bust. It did not work. Okay, so now I'm going to try um, some of the four ounce glues that I did happen to find on my last trip to Dollar Tree. These come in the two packs for Dollar. So um, a lot of people suggested to use these instead of those smaller containers. So I'm going to make some of fluffy slime. So I just poured out this glue into a small bowl and then I want to make pink so I added in a couple of drops of pink food coloring and mix those together. Actually it turned out more of like a purple pink. I used like a neon color. So just stir that really well together and then I got a ton of comments saying you added way too much shaving cream so this time I did not add that much shaving cream I have way more glue than I do shaving cream so I stirred that together and now I'm gonna use a borax activator same thing one cup of warm water one teaspoon of borax so like my other recipes I just added a little bit in at a time stirred it together and immediately you can see that it's starting to form that really nice slime ball consistency and actually after I did this I thought that I probably should have used a bigger bowl because it would have been a little bit easier to stir I have way too big of a spoon for a little bowl but that's okay it worked so just stir that together it's still really gooey and sticky so I'm gonna add a little more borax Stir that together really well. So let me know what you guys think about this color. Do you like the pink fluffy slime? What's your favorite fluffy slime color? My daughter likes the blue. She loves the, the baby blue colored fluffy slime. Okay, so one thing I did notice about this glue is that um, it took a lot more borax activator than Elmer's. It was really, really sticky. See, look at my hands, it's everywhere. So I had to add, keep adding just small amounts, small amounts until it wasn't so sticky and gooey on my hands. Now you'll notice whenever you use white glue to make slime, you'll get those like really stringy, um, they're like strings inside the slime and like when you stretch it out, they, they kind of want to pop, but that's normal. That's how, that, that's why the more you play with your slime, the better and the more squishy and stretchy that it will become. So, so far guys, this glue is working great. It took a little more borax activator, but it's really fluffy and squishy and you can just tell from the video how fluffy it is. So I kind of just worked, worked with it for a while and squeezed it and pulled it and, and it makes great poking noises. You guys, this glue works and it's 50 cents a bottle. I loved it. I'm so glad you guys left comments and that I tried again because I'll definitely be using this glue again. So I always appreciate you guys leaving me comments. I love talking to you. Um, be sure to leave a thumbs up and subscribe because I want to keep making slime videos and let me know what you'd like to see me do next. So I hope you guys have a great day and thanks so much for watching.